What's good everyone, it's Lowstar here, and this is part 5 of my Kingdom Hearts 358 over 2 days, uh, watch you playthrough. To be struggling. And yeah, let's continue. And nobody is interfering, I think. Who could that be? A nobody. I keep trying to piece his memory back together. But what if some of the pieces got lost? There would be no way for me to finish. If that happened, and they found their way into someone else, he'd never get them back. Oh, I think he can do without a memory or two. <laughs> but what, what if he needs those memories in order to wake up? What if they're the key? Namine, you're a witch who has power over Sora's memories and those connected to him. Are you seeing something I cannot? If his memories become her memories, she will never survive it. She? <laughs> there you go. Talking about Shion. For some reason, she is getting Sora's memories. Hey, Axel. Hmm? You've been to Castle Oblivion, right? Yeah. He <laughs> sure has. Hmm. What is it like? What's it like? Just an organization research facility. For research, huh? Seems everyone gets sent there all the time, especially you. Although, they never send me a Roxas. Well, they probably just don't need you there. <laughs> I'm... I'm heading back. Huh? <sighs> oh. Remember this happened to Roxas back in the start of Kingdom Hearts 2. Maybe you're not completely well yet. No, it's nothing like that. <clears throat> Got it! Huh? Got what? On our next day off, let's all go to the beach, huh? The beach? Where did that idea come from? We should go someplace different for a change. You're talking about That's a, a good vacation idea. with friends. Exactly. I'll join you, if I can. What are you talking about, Shion? It'll be a blast, trust me. <laughs> See, it, hmm. it's just yeah, like the, um... Right. Let's go. Oh, what would it... Yeah, it's like the uh, tutorial for Kingdom Hearts 2. Where uh, Roxas and his friends wanted to go to the beach. We all know how that ended. I sent Axel to Castle Oblivion last night to help expedite the matter we spoke of. I also instructed him to clear out our facilities there. He should return soon. And what of Namine? Still missing, sir. Ha <laughs> ha! Where or where could she be? Why, Zigbar. It almost sounds as though you know. <laughs> 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 so I didn't like that. Continue. Somebody accessed our main computer without authorization. And you expect us to believe you really don't know who it was. As if. Little Poppet is turning into a problem. Nonsense. I see no problem whatsoever. Ha <laughs> ha! Well, no. Apparently you don't. <laughs> Something you find it's funny amusing. considering it's coming from the guy one eye. Things you hear from a guy with no heart. No matter what unfolds, our plans remain unchanged. Axel, Roxas, and Shion will play the respective roles that Kingdom Hearts has given them. But sir, Shion, leave it be. How can you not see how perfect this is? In truth, this is more than perfect. Shion is marching right into the arms of destiny. 
but to destiny's own time. We need not take any more steps. All we must do is watch with caution and patience. Oh, looks like Shion's gone to uh, Castle Oblivion. My head hurts. So this is a flashback. This is the last you'll ever see of these walls, Shion. Doing here? I'm just here on orders, that's all. There's nothing for you to see here. Lies! This is the place I come from, I just know it! What about your mission? <sighs> Don't be selfish. Or else they'll turn me into a dusk? They'll do worse than turn you into a dusk. They'll just destroy you. And is that because I'm useless? That's not it. Shio, go home. I'm remembering things. I have memories of back when I was a human. Well, stop remembering. Nothing good will come of it. I have dreams every night. And you're in those dreams, Axel. Then they sure aren't <laughs> memories. How can I be a part of your past? They're just dreams, that's all. You can't fool me! We've met before, Axel! Right here in this castle! No, we have so not. That's basically Shion confirming that, Let's go uh... go home, Shion. She has Sora's memories. Don't keep Roxas waiting. Please, Axel. You've got to help me. I need to know who I am. Stop! Stay out of there, Shion! Good to see she did what she was told. <laughs> you're early. Ah, and this was the cutscene at the very start. No, you're where just we started late. it in the middle. So we're yeah, we're about round about halfway through the movie now. Today makes two hundred and fifty five. What's that about? It's been that many days since I first joined the organization. Man, time flies. So, you got the number memorized, do you? Yeah. Have to hang on to something, right? It's not like I have memories from before the organization. Don't you remember? I acted like a zombie. Right, that first week you could barely form a sentence. But come on, you're still kind of a zombie. Oh, Little lucky gang catch you glitch. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Roxas. Bet you don't know why the sun sets red. You see, light is made up of lots of colors. And out of all those colors, red is the one that travels the farthest. Oh, well, that's but when he points to himself. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously, where is she? <laughs> Excellent, nice. What? what? Then I... In the round room, Xemnas informed the assembled organization members of Xion's disappearance. He continued by prohibiting anyone from pursuing her. Unhappy with Xemnas' decision, Roxas argued that they should search for Xion, but was told that all will become clear when the time came, 
Semnis concluded the meeting with those words. Hmm. Well, at least they're not going after her, like, to harm her. The days passed without Xion. Axel no longer came to the usual spot, and, sh and Roxas sat alone eating his ice cream. Well, that's sad. Having a bit of a time skip. We're almost at 300 disorder. Oh, it's like one of the first cutscenes in the whole series. Oh, Rox has made his way to Disney Island. Oh yeah, from what I remember, this cutscene is actually quite weird. I don't 100% understand this cutscene either. Ah, <gasps> Zixian. Surely, you must have known that this was going to happen. Why would I know? And you remember this happened on Chain of Memories, on, in Riku's story. Because in your memory, You've been to a number of worlds before you came to this one. And, and of, course, of course, in those worlds, the only beings you met were the Dark Dark. Dark. That's, That's all that's left, left in your, your heart. heart. The dark darkest of memories. Your, your memories are long gone. gone. Every one. That's, that's a lie. I remember I everyone from the islands. The islands. They're, They're my... My... My closest my friends. friends. And you uh, threw away uh, those friends. Yes. Maybe it's your own Pretty actions. Pretty weird and dark scene. Uh, it was it you who destroyed your, your home. home. Pretty weird. Who am I? What am I here for? So we meet again. You made me a promise. I remember. It was to look after Sora. I'm sorry. I'm not sure I've kept that promise very well. Can you tell me what's happening? Some of Sora's memories are missing. Oh, how could that be? Sora's memories are escaping through Sora's nobody into a third person. And now, they're starting to become a part of her. Isn't there a way to bring back just Sora's memories? If they're still separate, then I think I can take out fragments of it. But if her memories and Sora's memory fragments are completely weaved together, I would need to untangle them from each other, and that would take more time. Which means it would take even longer before Sora can wake up again. No. And Diz wouldn't tolerate that. So what can you do? If I just jump in and rearrange her memory, then Sora might wake up. Only to find out that nobody remembers him anymore. Yeah, that would be pretty sad. That's a risk. I just can't take. It's too late either way. Sora's awakening has already been delayed. Sora's nobody. And the one that's absorbing his memory. None of us imagined that they would fight so hard to become their own people. Unfortunately, the only real solution is for them both to go away. Aww. Did you know? Her face was blank at first. But now, there is a face that is clearly visible. I think that's proof that she has entered Sora's memories. 
Sora's memories, Sora's nobody's memories, and her memories. They're all a jumbled mess now, and to put them back into one, I'm afraid there's no other way. All right. Well, we know that uh, at the start of Kingdom Hearts 2, Roxas was having Sora's memories. Um, but Roxas returned to Sora, so we don't know yet what happens to Shion. And the memories that are going with her. Is it that I'm not supposed to exist? Well, what do you want to do, Shion? I want... I want to be... with you two. Then come back with us. I can't. Not the way I am now. But... what would it take for me to be like you? Been a while. You think so? <laughs> so, I went to the beach today. And there was this girl who looked kind of like Shion. But I couldn't get close enough to tell for sure. Mm, I you could be talking about it. Kyrie. To be honest, I'm not even sure today's mission really happened. Feels like I just woke up from a dream or something. Do you remember our promise? When we said that the three of us would go to the beach on our next break? Maybe that's why. Maybe I saw Shion there because I wanted her to be there. Want to go look for her? Huh? Beginning tomorrow, let's use our spare time to find Shion. Mm hmm. Sounds good. Let's do that. Hmm. Searching. While visiting a world on a mission, Roxas met the always cryptic Cashier Cat. Before disappearing, the Cashier Cat responded to Roxas' question by saying that he must follow his heart and decide what to believe in. Would having a heart resolve everything, including Xion's predicament? Roxas was left pondering over what he could believe in when he doesn't possess a heart. Roxas and Axel continued their search for Xion. Yeah, don't think they found her. <laughs> 